Days of heavy rain has caused widespread flooding across Central Europe. At least 17 people have been killed as Storm Boris has devastated the region, ravaging towns and knocking out power. In Romania, entire neighborhoods and villages have been submerged. One villager in Galati County lost her pets and livestock in addition to her home. Across Central Europe, tens of thousands of people have been asked to evacuate. In Poland, officials say at least five people have died. The surging water levels collapsing bridges and breaching dams, leaving behind a trail of destruction. Płytki pozrywały podłogi, pozrywały ściany, poprzewracały. Można zobaczyć tu nawet przez okno sfotografować. Ściany są poprzewracane. 56-year-old Derek watched his home fill with water on Sunday. His son says his room no longer exists and everything is gone. Straty są no nie niewyobrażalne są dla miasta. Mosty wszystkie są popękane. Ech. No to jest miasto wygląda jak apokalipsa. Tak jak jak ja to nazwę, to jest miasto widmo tak naprawdę. Today, Polish officials declaring a national disaster, setting up shelters in schools and community centers. Meanwhile, in Austria, the capital of Vienna has also been hard hit. I've never seen uh, fighting like this. We're on a cruise and we're stuck. And for days, where the boat's not even moving. But the main concern is dams threatening to overflow. The fact that the, the roads are closed and the uh, bus system is all shut down practically and I have to find another way to get home is stressful. As the impacts continue to be felt across Central Europe, Boris isn't done yet. Hungary and Slovakia are preparing for the next wave where more heavy rain and more flooding is expected. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.